Are you going to let me know what you want in yeah, your so hair? Normally I go like a, a three into a four and then just I okay. tell Blend people whatever works on top. Got it. Kind of what you have, just sort of. So how have things been so far with the uh, changes? We got here, started my first client at 8 a.m. Yeah, six weeks. Has it been tough? Oh yeah. I mean, you've got not only Am I not all of a sudden not working? I'm taking care of kids at home with school. And the best thing was when we all, you know, figured out we didn't have to go to work anymore, but at least the owner of the salon, you know, the salons that we work at. The salon. The salon. A university of. <laughs> Tell us we didn't have to pay her rent for a little while. That was really helpful. For the people coming in to get their hair cut, uh -huh. what do they need to know? We're asking them not to bring anybody else with them. We're asking them to make sure that their hands are washed, they sanitize, we have sanitation up in the front. Masks are need to be worn. It's been pretty smooth today, to be honest. I mean, it's, I really thought it was gonna be horrible and it's been good and I think we're just all really happy to be back. For you, what was the decision to open up today rather than the 18th? Wait, the 18th? Part of the reason was, is definitely because I was, I'm able to, to be in here. If I had, to work in a big salon, there's no way I would be working. Like, there's none. It's a little weird. It's better than not being able to work, right?